Finley High School won a three track teams in the postseason this year and rewarded with a long trip to the 10th rated team in Division I, Dublin Jerome outside of Columbus. So a big school battle, the Trojans and the Celtics. Sounds like something James Lotzenheiser, the Crestview football coach and history teacher would love. Anytime Celtics and Trojans get together, you think of an old novel. Dublin Jerome gets things started. Handed off to Austin Booth, first in the end zone for the first score of the night. Finley looking to answer, third and 12, Trey Miller. Keeps it, but the ball bounces out of bounds as it comes out, so it's a first down for Finley. Some luck at Celtic Stadium, then it's Miller. In trouble, going down, short loss, Don Stinson makes a little out of nothing. Finley going for it, fourth and 10. Miller looking to the end zone, his receiver tips it. Ray Prochko makes the grab for the interception, but it wouldn't take Finley long to get the ball back as Dublin's Joe Doonan looks deep, but Finley's Kyle Nunn, the Pittsburgh recruit. Nice pick over the shoulder. That could be a Layfield Welding top five play. Gives Finley the ball back on a weekend that Ben Roethlisberger might come back from injury for the Steelers. Of course, Finley alum. Miller been under pressure all night. Gets it here. Picks up another nice gain on the ground. We know that Finley offense can score in a hurry. Head to the second quarter. Finley threatening. They hand it off to none. Would not be denied. Takes on seven defenders. Puts two spin moves. Another Layfeld welding top five play, possibly. Finley ties it at seven, but in the end, they fall, and their fine season comes to a close 42-7. Dublin Jerome.